probably happened the same for most musicians that would start out in the 80s. Um, first it was, a, I remember, a Sanyo Ghetto Blaster, real cheapy, or Radio Shadow, just a cheap Ghetto Blaster. And you'd, uh, I would borrow my parents or somebody else's cassette Ghetto Blaster and tape to tape. You know, like you'd play along to your riff on one uh, cassette player and then you'd record both onto the next terrible sound. Then it evolved into the, you know, the Tascam Fostex four track cassette. And, uh, you know, the ADATs came out and revolutionized, you know, they, the ADATs came out and that was it. I think most, uh, a lot of studios went under when those came in and people like me could now record in our own homes, home studios. Um, yeah, and then it just evolved. It's just getting better and better for musicians and engineers, producers. They have the best of both worlds now.